lineup for the Kaloska Lions today features two under 23 players in Mabasso and uh, Lela Letze, as well as uh, quite a few uh, one pointers or low pointers, which are always uh, important for the teams because those people allow you to put up the uh, larger or the higher pointers on the court for your 14 points. The Kalakspan uh, Mongoose. They uh, feature two under-21 players, uh, Kamalo and Ramon, and Ramon has been having a, a fantastic season so far, and uh, hopefully that will uh, carry on for him. And uh, one point is uh, Sean Hartnick, and uh, one and a half in Matsakwa. That's always important for the team, for the points. And the match officials, courtesy of the Sassel Technical Excellence Program. From left to right, it's Arnold Masaya, Charles Foster and Charles Minetti. And with me in commentary is Kevin Smith. It is the Mongoose, right to left. And they're in the purple. About to take the first shot of this second round game being played here at the Vodacom Mandeville Indoor Centre. And uh, remember, it is the 2019 Supersport Wheelchair Basketball Series. Cecil Dumont looking for the attempt for the Colosco Lions. Colosco playing left to right in the white and the Mongoose right to left in the purple. So we just had a jump ball situation, but uh, that means the uh, Lions have the put in. Tandil is on looking for the first points of the game not finding them and here come the mongoose and kevin the mongoose are a vastly improved side they certainly are andy and uh, you know they've got nice uh, depth as well and uh, you know they've come a long way they're not going to be intimidated by the colosco lions that's for sure and here are the mongoose first basket of the game taken psychologically that's always just a little jab in the arm Still doing his business there, Rob Williams, for the Mongoose. But here is the response. Kolosko opened their account, ready to rock and roll. Here, yeah, Dlamini, Velapi Dlamini. This is Rob Williams bringing it over the line. Played most of his basketball in his heyday in the Cape. Turning out now for a very grateful Mongoose side. Always good to have an experienced player in the side. And that is another two points to the Mongoose. And it was Adinga Madingi playing at number 12. Yeah, Lions uh, picking up a basket. That's uh, Rakateng Moleti. Here's Rolf Williams. We'll flick back long shot going up for the mongoose and bingo i'll take that three pointer and kumala particularly happy give yeah, us he, a little dance he really enjoyed that he certainly did and uh, when those go in like that it's as clean as a whistle huge confidence tandy lezonke favorite spot on the court and uh, result generally good for two like that uh, foul again this time on it looks like it'll be Shane Williams will come to the line well Shane Williams did very well he corrected the shot Made no mistake, and uh, we locked up at seven apiece with just on four minutes to go. And the mongoose, quick as a flash, into the opposition half of the court. Rolf Williams, well, that was the Rolf Williams of old. He was a deadly shooter in, in the day. 
carry to in the game as well. Good defence from the Mongoose, holding out a very strong line side. Tandile Zonke with the response, nine points apiece, locked up here. And the Mongoose holding their own against the Lions. Who would have thought? William Ruba. Yeah, and William Ruba making no mistake with that shot. And Kevin, good to see uh, Ralph Williams doing a little bit of talking on the court now because uh, he's been quiet in the few games that we have seen him, but he's got all the experience and he's able to rally the troops, organize the play, and uh, certainly a very good eye for the game. Yeah, certainly has. And, uh, you know, yeah, as you say, he's got a wealth of experience, as has that man who just scored that basket, Tandili Zonke. But uh, Ralph Williams will bring... Uh, a huge amount of guidance to the Mongoose team. Here come the Lions. Uh, Rocketing Moletti uh, fouled in the process. Going for the basket, so he'll have two free shots. Moletti missing out on the first. Opportunity to sneak into the lead if he can sink the second. Odinga Mandingi, the man who committed the foul for the Mongoose. Zonke for the Kolosko Lions. Puts it into Shane Williams. Williams looking for options at the top of the key. Pushes it to the left-hand side of the court. And that was a very well-worked basket. Ball doing all the work. And uh, the bench is happy. That's Elis Langemann. And that's how you take your time and make sure. Percentage basketball, it looked a little bit static, but uh, 1,000, 2,000, and Fulani Kumalo taking those points. So they're still within one, the Mongoose. Now the basket does drop the... And it's so good to see the sponsors putting their money where their mouths are. They are here to support the Colosco Lions and uh, welcome on board. Hopefully there's some other corporates out there that are looking to say, well, why don't we get involved in this amazing game and give these guys the opportunities. William Ruba. And he did well to control that. There was lots of topspin and Ruba coming away with an excellent layup. Moletti doing some good work on the left-hand side of the court. And Williams, this time it does drop. Basket probably will count. It certainly will. And he'll get one from the top. And he'll get one. Guilty party was uh, Sean Hartnick. No problem this time. So he's on the score sheet is Shane Williams. That ball finding Shane Williams. And again, Williams reversing away from the basket and attempting the shot. That pass is going to count. And he'll have one shot. So virtually identical for Shane Williams. Tricky again, shot, drawing a foul. Again, the guilty party was uh, Sean Hartnick. Can he complete the trio? Yes, he can. So, six points for Shane Williams in virtually exactly the same situation. Taking two and uh, drawing a couple of fouls and then scoring the three points. And that is how you harvest points. Williams, side of the key, looking for the long shot. That used to be the trademark shot. And there is an excellent underhand loop. That's Monometsi. A lot of clumsy fouls coming from uh, the Mongu side. Familiar face. Looking for some more points from the free throw line. And he's got his eye in now deadly from that uh, free throw line 
Yeah, and the reason he's having uh, two free shots is because the Mongoose are now on collective fouls. Four minutes to go and they're on collective fouls. Well, I think, uh, I think looking at that, Williams could just sit and do that all day. Good basket as the Colosco Lions just keep it rolling. Baskets raining in then for Shane Williams. And suddenly there's a big, big difference. Good basket taken, good basket scored. One from two on the free shots for the Mongoose. Yeah, rebound well picked up by uh, Gifton Berry. Shot William from Ruba. the side and Excellent shot from William Ruba. That's been coming. He's been there or thereabouts. 50% shooting for Ruba. The little 17-year-old playing some fantastic basketball. But the Lions are unstoppable at the moment. And the Lions, certainly if they continue this, they're on their way to a bonus point because we are still half a minute in the first half and 34 points to the good. They've just changed gear as we knew they would or knew they could. Mongoose, another two points. So far the Lions 36 over the Mongoose 24 at half time. The two pointers, 44% average for the Lions, that's 15 out of 34, and 10 out of 32 for the Mongoose, 31%. Seven points needed for that magical bonus point for the Lions. That should be a formality the way that they play. Particularly this man, Shane Williams, he with the headband. Yeah, the Lions passing the ball well, but they're all very static. They need to pick up their uh, movement a bit. They're not going to commit uh, or convert any um, gaps there, but uh, Tandili Zonki obviously had other ideas. Just when you thought that he wasn't on form, Zonke puts in a peach. Yeah, he's only hit up four out of 12. Ruba being well watched by Dumont. And the Mongoose early response. They just need to get themselves on a roll, do the Mongoose. They need to be sinking more baskets more consistently. Good control from Moletti. Well, the boss gets raining in for the Lions. Yes, yeah, Tandili Zonki on his favorite side. Just when you thought that Tandili Zonki wasn't going to be much or much of a factor in the game, two very quick and two very slick baskets.
Yeah, well, the Mongoose are also putting the baskets down. That's Kamalo. Williams, great little pass over. Good combination play between Shane Williams and Tandeli Zonke. Great interpassing skills. Ball doing all the work, and it's always nice to see a movement like that ending up in a basket. Yeah, they had to, the Mongols had to uh, get that pass going because uh, the eight seconds were lapsing for them to get it over the half. But just couldn't reel it in. Kolosko Lions requiring five points to secure the bonus point. And that'll do a lot of good stuff for them on the log because in the earlier game, the Eagles missed out by one point. And uh, it all matters, particularly towards the end, of, as we see Tandela Zonke now by the Lions are passing very, very tidy. And that is how you take a layup from the lap in control, William Ruber. He's done it a few times. One of the better exponents of that particular shot. Never an easy shot, particularly when the opposition are raining down, putting all the pressure on you, and you're taking it off the lap in front of the basket. It's a technique. And Williams has put them within one point. Yeah, Shane Williams and uh, Tande Lizonki working very well together. They have combined particularly well. Eight from 14 for Shane Williams. And of course, he harvested a load of points as well so far. Eight from 10. So that gives him a total of 24 points in the game so far, taking into account his free shots. Hey, Mongoose are on attack. And Ruba doing very well there, knowing the proximity of Shane Williams. Long shot, three points. I'll take those. Not a great pass from the Mongoose. And it was clear that this was going to happen. And Shane Williams, he is your MVP. Man of the match, Shane Williams, he's done it again. He's been the man of the match before in the 2019 season and very well deserved. He came on and he held the side together. He's done all of the damage. He's got an excellent harvest in terms of points. And here he is again, stealing a loose ball, getting it through to Rachet Simoletti. He did so well just to scoot his way around, find a loose player. Two more points to the Lions' cause. Ramon looking a little shell-shocked in this game. Yeah, I don't know what he's trying to do with the ball there, but he lost it all by himself. And the baskets just keep coming for the Colosco Lions. It was a very slow start. They had a particularly slow first quarter. Not that impressive in the second. It all started to click, but they've simply run away with the game at this point in time. Well, the e end of the first quarter score, Gandhi was 12-11 uh, in favour of the Lions. So only one point difference. Who wants it? A uh, bit of aerial ping pong. Long shot. Oh, what a fabulous shot. What a shot. Three-pointer. Another three-pointer, yeah. Kamalo, two from five on the three-pointers. Very, very well taken. Another three-point attempt effort. Hitting the front of the uh, hoop. Tandeli Zonki just picking up that foul, but uh, arguing the point. But uh, he was, yeah, he pushed the player. So into the dying seconds of this uh, clash here at the Vodacom Mandeville Indoor Centre. A couple of free shots to come from the Mongoose. And uh, Monometsi 
taking the first of two. And they're actually having these uh, shots because of uh, the Lions being on collective fouls. Wow, two from two, a little too late. Yeah, two great uh, free throws. Too little too late from Monomezzi, but uh, good for the soul anyway. Matsakwa picking up that, uh, that foul for the Mongoose. Sixteen seconds and counting. Long shot going up from Tandili Zonke. No change to the score sheet as a result. This could be Monometsi with an excellent little hook shot. He's certainly come into his own towards the end of the game. And there's no need for the Mongoose to be embarrassed, Kevin. It's a very impressive performance. That is the final hooter. The full time, the Lions with a deserved win. The two-pointers, you look at their uh, percentage uh, shooting on the two-pointers is 48% and 37% for the Mongoose. So they put up a lot of shots, but uh, not converting too many of them. Turnovers, a bit even there, but uh, not really a problem on either side. And then the point analysis, 48% coming from the uh, Lions for the uh, two-pointers, hitting 10 out of 17 for the free throws. What a great uh, effort from the, uh, from the Lions on that, that side. And Shane Williams, the uh, most valuable player, pretty much doing everything for the Lions there. And the Mongoose, Monometsi, the top scorer, but Kumala, Ruba, Monometsi, and Ndingi doing all the rest. After a shaky start, it took a lone performance to change things. And uh, for the Colosco Lions, your MVP, man of the match, it's uh, once again Shane Williams. Shane, congratulations. Fantastic solo performance. Some good linking up there with Tandili Zonke, but you, you literally had to change the pattern of that game. Yeah, Andy, uh, first of all, I'd like to start to say thank you to the sponsor, Kiloska. Uh, I think it's, it's, it's a thing where the team has pulled it together in the second quarter the first quarter was a bit rough but i think we needed to warm up properly but yeah we managed to pull it together and how does that feel when you it's, it's almost like a gear change in the game we saw that uh and then you came in and just reined in a, a, up until the point where you scored all the free the, the from the free point line you were missing baskets and you just suddenly got the confidence and took off oh well i guess it, it's any player i think they need to get the confidence when the first basket starts to sink and that then afterwards you, you get the momentum and start going. And how do you feel your season's going so far? Because I think this is your second Man of the Match performance. Uh, I think it can go a little bit better, but I have to thank my teammates as well for, for producing the ball at the right time. So big thanks to them. Eh? Well, congratulations. Yet again, you'll be able to start your own little bag manufacturing and storage <laughs> yeah. company. Well done from Supersport. You are the MVP. And uh, as always, very, very humble in accepting the award. Fantastic player, fantastic performance, and congratulations to the Colosco Lions.